Hello guys, this is Ashley back again. Today, when I'm filming this, this is the last day of September. Um, so tomorrow is October, which I've already been celebrating Halloween. <laughs> um, I've already had my inside, de inside decorations up for about two weeks now. But October 1st is like kind of the day that my husband and I agreed on that is we can finally start celebrating like Halloween full out. So a little tidbit, Halloween is one of my favorite holidays. Um, I think it's really close with Christmas, but I love Halloween because I love the dress up. I love fall. I love all the spooky, creepy things. Um, I have a little Mackie hanging out with me today. She's a little sweetie pie. She doesn't like spooky, scary things. But today I wanted to bring some Halloween themed um, blind bags, mystery things. I've had some of these for a while. Um, some of these are old. Some of these are brand new. Um, so I just want to share those with you today. Um, tell me what you think. Do you like Halloween? Do you celebrate Halloween? Do you go all out for Halloween? I just put out a bunch of decorations. My husband and I actually make decorations. We've made some haunted trees and we're going to make some tombstones this year. So tell me what you think about Halloween. What If it's not your favorite holiday, what is your favorite holiday? Okay, and also I'm really stuffy, really sniffly because the seasons are changing. Um, we're finally getting some cooler weather, but a lot of things are still trying to die. <laughs> I always make the joke the winter is my favorite season because everything's dead. <laughs> so I don't have any allergies. Okay, anyway, so let's look at some of these blind bag things. I'm really excited about these. Um, they're Hocus Pocus. Um, figural keychains. Um, now, let me think. Spirit Halloween has these. Um, I think they were like eight dollars a piece, so that's that's quite a bit. But I mean, the other figural keychain keychains like this were about that price. But they have the Funko Pops of the three um, Sanderson sisters as well that I really want. Um, some of the other things like these little um, My Little Ponies got these for eighty cents at uh, Walgreens. They were on sale, so that tells you how old those are. Um, but I thought they were cute for Halloween. And I got some um, Harry Potter mystery wands from Walmart. Um, and we'll take a look at those. Let's actually, let's do the My Little Ponies first, I think. Because since these are so old. Um, there's 24 to collect. These are Friendship is Magic Collection. There it is. I found it. Yay. Okay. I think these, do they have a tear strip? No, they don't. Wait a second, a little mag magic happening right now. Ta-da! So with a little magic for Halloween, <laughs> I got my scissors. They say foam because this is supposed to be for foam. But we don't do costumes that much anymore using foam. So anyways, I need some scissors to cut these. At least make a little slit. I think these cards tell you what you get. So, okay, I got to open it the right way. All right, so if you've never seen the... um. Uh, Friendship is Magic Collection. It made me think of Halloween. Here they are. Um, let's see. Of course, I love Fluttershy. I've already said that. And I love Pinkie Pie. Ooh, I really want Gilda the Griffin, though. Okay, let's see who we get. <gasps> uh, shoot. Who's this? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Carrot Cake. Oh, he's so cute. I like Mr. Carrot Cake. Maggie, do you like Mr. Carrot Cake? Here's his card he loves baking baking is good for the fall halloween season need to bake some things we actually made rice crispy treats recently it's not really baking but all right let's see which other one we get okay there they are again let's see oh what's her name oh yeah miss dazzle cake oh she makes cuppy cakes She's so sweet looking. I love her like curly mane and curly tail. So cute. She'll go right there with Mr. Carrot Cake because they like to make cakes and cuppy cakes together. Okay. Let's do another one. Bottom bum 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 bottom. Oh, Princess Cadence is cute too. Oh, cute. Who is this? I forgot. Um, Raven Inkwell. I love that name. It's kind of Halloween-ish, like, color-wise. And she's cute. She is so trustworthy. Sweet. Oh, she has little piggy tail-looking things. It's a little bit different than the picture, but that's okay. Mackie, you knocked him over. 
She just wants to be right in the middle of the attention, and she's probably going to knock those over, like, everywhere. <laughs> okay, two more of these. I'm trying to do this quick because I realize a lot of my videos are super long, like 20 minutes long. So I'm trying to do this as quick as I can, but, you know, I like to talk. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, rain cloud. See, she looks kind of like she's spooked. We have Sprinkle Medley. She loves guessing games. Ooh. I like the little storm cloud as her um, cutie mark. Whoa, hello, focus. She looks kind of scared. Like, her eyes are really big and wide. Maybe that works for Halloween. We'll put her by the Sanderson sisters. She's scared of them. <laughs> um, Let's see. One more. Last one of these. I know these are old, but they're still cute anyways. <gasps> Ooh, it's a sparkly Pinkie Pie. Oh, no, it's not. The Ribbon Wishes. I thought it was Pinkie Pie. It's hard to see through this visor. Whoa, hello. So, Ribbon Wishes. She's pretty. She's cute. Okay, let's look at the mystery ones now. So, for Halloween, if you want to be like a wizard or you want to be some Harry Potter character, you could try your luck with one of these. And then you can use this as a prop. So, there's nine mystery ones, and they're like standard size ones. I'm interested to see what they're kind of made of, if they're plastic or what. They, it feels really light, so it's probably plastic. Um, but you can get Harry Potter's wand, Hermione Granger's wand, Ron Weasley's, Draco's. Neville's, um, a Death Eater wand, Lord Voldemort's wand, Nymphador Tonks, Luna Lovegood. Tonks's is pretty. Um, I actually made a Luna Lovegood one for my um, Luna Lovegood cosplay, and I made it out of polymer clay. So it'd be cool to have like an actual one. But any of these would be really neat to have. I actually have Hermione Granger's wand already um, from Universal Studios. It's one of those interactive ones. So really anything besides that one because I already have that one. Oh gosh. I may have to use a little bit more magic. Hang on. Ta da! Magic. Alright. Let's see. Ooh, big old box. Okay, so it says on the sides and the front. It's like that new packaging they have for all the new release Harry Potter stuff, like Target and Walmart that they have. Okay. Inside, um, whose was this? Uh, shoot, I remember seeing it. Is this, this isn't Ron's, is it? Yeah, cool. This is Ron's. Right there. Ron Weasley's wand. Now, I don't know if this is, like, supposed to be carrot cake. Mr. Carrot Cake. I don't know if this is supposed to be, like, his pre-Chamber of Secrets wand. Um, I'm assuming it is be really neat to do like some spello tape on it to make it like look authentic but um anyways let's see some focusing pretty neat little detail got like the wood looks like a piece of bark actually carved down and slimmed down it's actually got like some divots in it so it looks like it's actually carved yeah this is just plastic but it's kind of like pretty good heavy duty plastic i got a wand um when harry potter was really big from golden grotto and it was like thin, plasticky, like, cheap plastic. This actually is a pretty good size. <gasps> it's Mimi! Beep, boop! No, it didn't work. Okay. Um, let's try the other one with a little help from some magic. Ta-da! And now Mimi's over there. <laughs> okay. She's checking out my trash. Let's see what... This one is. I think these were at Walmart, like I said. I think they were $13. So kind of expensive, but and it's a mystery, so you don't know what you're going to get. But it's still pretty neat. <gasps> Excuse me. I think this is Harry's wand. Yeah, this is Harry's wand. Um, Wait, there's something inside. Let me look. Da -da 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 -da. <gasps> Ooh, sweet. Okay, cool. Let me look at the other one. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. <gasps> That's what I get for not looking. Ooh, I love these. They're like bookmarks, but they're like the movable, like they move a little bit. Ooh, how cool is that? So yeah, that helps you. Even if you don't know, that's like a little bonus item. I like that a lot. Even though Ron looks kind of, I don't know. It looks like he's wearing a wig, which is kind of weird. 
but anyway cool so yeah we got harry's wand now so good and then i ha hey i have the golden trios wands now because i have the hermione interactive wand then i have harry's this is harry's and i have ron's that's pretty neat i'm gonna display those pretty cool i really like how theirs look very rustic stands out really well all right so I could use those as kind of like decorations for um, Halloween to sit up because if you see I got like my little sign right there and stuff. Um, I like to set up little decorations throughout the house so I could use those. Okay, so moving on to the thing that I really wanted to open. Um, the Hocus Pocus figural keychains. I love Hocus Pocus. It's like a traditional Halloween staple just like Nightmare, Nightmare Before Christmas. is just a traditional Christmas and Halloween movie. Um, so you can get all of these. You can get Winifred, Sar Sarah, Mary, and Danny is the witch, which is so cute. Um, Max, Billy Butcherson, and Binks. And then there's two exclusives as well. And I can kind of tell from that one. I think I know what this one is. It looks like a human form of Thackeray Binks. <laughs> and, um, and then I think this exclusive A, I'm not 100% sure if it may be his sister, Emily, or if it may be, um, um, wow, I feel really dumb. I blanked, uh, Allison, <laughs> or if it's Allison, the, uh, love interest. Okay, so let's see, do these have a carry strip? No, they don't. All right, I'm going to have to use a little bit of scissor magic again. I really, really want Binks and Danny, and then, of course, the three Sanderson sisters would be great. I may get duplicates, because I grabbed these from, like, two different bags, but anyway, let's see. Oh, <gasps> yay! It's Sarah. She's so cute. Got her wavy blonde hair. She's not super detailed like some of the other figures I've seen before, but you can tell who she is for sure. Um... My cousin and I have always talked about wanting to cosplay as the Sanderson sisters, and then um, I would be Sarah. So I really think that that's super cute. Whoa, sorry, I just hit the, the camera. Yay! So Sarah Sanderson. All right, let's see who's in this one. I hope we get a mystery and exclusive. Oh, Winifred! Yay! I might get all the sisters. Let's cross our fingers. <laughs> she's got her little lips like pursed up with her little lipstick on. See, she's a little bit more detailed. She's even got like the cutouts in her arm. Ooh, little purple earrings. I always loved her hair. Like it, it just defies gravity. <laughs> so super cute. Winifred Sanderson. Okay. Let's cross our fingers. We don't get very many duplicates. Let's see what's next. An exclusive. It is Zachary or Thackeray. <laughs> uh, it's Binks in human form. Zachary Binks. Oh, he's so cute. I always felt so sorry for him um, being trapped as a cat all those years, and you know his family thinking that he just left and not knowing what happened to his sister. But it all worked out in the end. Um, and then of course it was really sad when, like, it's not really sad because Binks can't die technically until he, you know, is released from his form. Um, but it always makes me cry when Beats gets run over by the bus. Because I've had a lot of bad instances with my pets and cars. And I know Binks comes back, but it always makes me sad. All right. Oh, wow. Okay. So somebody's probably mad at me. <laughs> because I just got the exclusive. And like I said, I pulled these from two boxes. So I just got a duplicate of Thackeray Binks. <laughs> I like these that they've started putting the barcodes on them. So, like, if I wanted to return it, I could. But I, I don't feel like I'm that kind of person that would return it. Because I know some people who would really want something like this. So, I will share that. Oh, that's it. I only got four. I thought I got five. Okay. Well, I wish I would have got Binks in the cat form. But that's okay. I like Binks in his regular form. And we got two of the three sisters. So, these are super cute. I hope I can get... I might try and get a few more... Um, I don't know. They're kind of expensive. Like I said, $8 for 
the keychain, and then I got the duplicate, but he's an exclusive. Um, so the wands were 13 and then I got the little ponies for 80 cents. So yeah, that's, that's what I like to do is pile, like, things up, like, look at things, and, um, and clearance aisles, and I'm always checking out clearance aisles, I'm always checking out, um, sale things, and finding new things as well. So, um, yeah, little bitty Halloween haul. So, I hope that you're having a good start off to your October soon. Get all your decorations up. Make sure you carve a jack-o'-lantern and keep it lit on your porch. Um, and don't forget to give out candy or you will get your house egged and teepeed. So, alright, um, I will see you guys sometime soon. Bye!